Welcome to the ProWall International Manufacturing Service and Support Library. In this video, we'll go over the various mode options on the large hot water system and where to find each valve on the large hot water system decal. At ProWall, we've engineered the large hot water system to maintain the water temperature for customers pouring in climates as cold as negative 40 degrees Celsius or negative 40 degrees Fahrenheit. This additional option can help to extend the life of your equipment while saving you time and money by eliminating the downtime required to thaw a frozen mixer. It's important to note that our hot water systems are used to maintain the temperature of the water. They are not boiler systems. The water tank must be filled with warm water as the system will not be able to warm it up. The large hot water system circulates water through the heat exchanger on the truck, allowing the heat from the engine to maintain the water temperature throughout the entire water system. To heat the Admix system, the large hot water system runs hot water to through heating coils in the Admix tanks. On the pump cover of your mixer, you'll find a decal showing the different operating modes for the large hot water system. The decal shows the position that each valve needs to be in order for various operations to work. If the diagram shows a black circle, this indicates that the corresponding valve is closed. Before we begin, make sure the ball valve to the pump is open or you could run the pump dry, damaging your machine. Now, let's go over the various operating modes for the large hot water system. Mode A is your mix mode. This is when your mixer is ready to pour. Do not attempt to pour in modes B, C, D, or E. Setting your hot water system to mode B will allow the system to maintain the water tank temperature. This mode is used when transporting the mixer to and from job sites. In mode C, your hot water system will maintain the water temperature at the tank and provide freeze prevention throughout the water system when the water system is primed. This mode is used during stoppages in the middle of a pour or once water is introduced to the water system, but you are not ready to pour yet. In mode D, your hot water system will maintain the water temperature at the tank, circulate water throughout the water system, and circulate water to the heating coils in the Admix tanks. This will provide freeze prevention for the water delivery system and keep the Admix tanks warm. This mode is used for extended periods of downtime or when you want to prepare for a pour in cold climates. Mode E is when draining or blowing out the system. When working in weather where the water system has the potential to freeze, always drain and blow out the water system using pressurized air when your mixer is not in use. Now, we'll go over the various valve locations to help you navigate the large hot water system on your mixer. Valves 1, 2, and 3 are located below the heat exchanger between the water pump and Y strainer. Valves 4 and 5 are drain valves located to the left of the pump cover. Valves 6 and 7 are located on the truck engine. Please note that these locations vary from manufacturer to manufacturer. Valves 8 and 9 are located on the left side of the heat exchanger behind the cover. Please note that valve 9 is only present on older models. Valve 10 is located underneath the heat exchanger. Valve 11 is located underneath the heat exchanger on the left side. Valve 12 is located under the heat exchanger. Valve 13 is located under the heat exchanger to the left of the pump cover. Valves 14 and 15 are located on top of the Admix tanks. Please note that if your system has more than two tanks, you'll need to set the valves on those tanks to the same setting as valves 14 and 15 while working in each mode. Valve 16 and 17 are located between the pump cover and the Admix tanks. Valve 18 is an electronic valve located inside the liquids cabinet. This valve is controlled using the commander control system. Valves 19 and 20 are located at the rear of the mixer above the mix bowl. Valve 21 is located above the pump cover to the left of the Admix tank. Valve 22 is the on, off, auto switch that is located beside the tarp switch near valves 1, 2, and 3. It has a red LED light above it that comes on when the pump is running in on or auto mode. Now that you know where to find each valve, use the diagram on the pump cover to determine which position each valve needs to be in for whichever mode you'd like to use. If you have any questions, please contact the ProAll customer service team at 1-833-5-PROALL or email support at proallinc.com.